Hey y'all, hey, Vaughn Twins, Twins here. here. I'm Kiana. And I'm Kenya. And welcome back to our channel, guys. Welcome, welcome. So today we want to bring to you all something that has been requested. Yes. We have listened to you guys. And so we are going to deliver on what was requested. And that is another perfume video. Yes. <laughs> so guys, okay. this one is the inexpensive mm -hmm. perfume scents that... Edition. Yes. <laughs> that Kiana and I have been absolutely loving for quite some time now. Now, before we get into the video, we do want to remind you guys to go on ahead and click the subscribe button if you have not already. And <laughs> turn on that bell so that you'll be notified any and every time Kenya and I upload a new video. Yes, yes, yes. We will not be before you long, so without further ado. Hey, let's get it. Hey, let's go. 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 All right. So, since we are still in the winter months, you guys, I want to bring to you guys a scent that I've been absolutely loving as of late. We just finished Christmas. Right. So, I picked up a scent that you all may still be able to find, and that is Twisted Peppermint by Bath and Body Works. Now, I love, love, love this scent, and I love it so much so that I bought it in a travel size, just one to like stay in my car, you right. guys. I love this, and the reason why is because it <clears throat> smells like peppermint. It smells like winter. It smells like a fresh blend of cool peppermint, sugar, snow, and fresh balm. Mm. <laughs> so go pick this up. It is 75% off right now at Bath and Body Works. Yes. Now, the second scent that I am gonna talk about is one that falls right in line with the festive season, with the Christmas season, just with the holiday season. And I consider January to still be the holiday season, Absolutely. right? Absolutely, yes. Like, how many of y'all have not taken down y'all tree? Right. right. Uh, <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Exactly, <laughs> tree don't come down till February. I mean, when you think about all of the work that you have to do to put up the tree and to make right. it look beautiful, you don't wanna just take it down right after Christmas. I mean, some people do, and we're not judging if you do. However, however, yeah. We like to savor the Christmas season <laughs> for as long as we can, you feel me? <laughs> Indubitably. Indubitably. <laughs> so with that being said, guys, one of my favorite scents that I pick up every single holiday season is mm. the Vanilla Bean Noel. This is it right here. Again, this is from Bath & Body Works. A lot of these scents that we are going to talk about are going to be from Bath & Body Works mm. because they smell amazing and they're super inexpensive. That's right. This one right here, it goes without saying. It smells like fresh vanilla mm. um, and it has a bit of a musk smell as well but it's like a, on the sweeter side again along with a sugary vanilla which balances the scent out perfectly so I think this is an all-time favorite of a lot of people's and it's one of mine as well all <laughs> right so keeping along with that trend you guys um I have been loving another scent by Bath & Body Works and this is toasted praline and That's good. hair Oh, that is good. I love this so much. Now, if you all can see, Kenya and I love dessert-like scents. Mm -hmm, we do. <laughs> so, toasted praline and pear, you guys. It smells like pies. <laughs> and it also smells warm and nutty. And it smells like pears and toasted praline, graham cracker, and tonka Ooh, bean. Graham you guys, cracker. like, mmm. It smells so good to me. Yes. My only gripe about this, you guys, is that my body chemistry tends to make everything sweeter. sweeter. And it's already sweet, a pretty sweet smell. Yeah. Uh, excuse yeah. me, a pretty sweet fragrance. And so therefore, my body chemistry, it makes it sweeter. Yeah. Nonetheless, it still smells amazing. It if does. you all find this scent <clears throat> and spread it on you, people are gonna be like, mm, what is it? What? I, I think I want apple pie for this. Exactly. <laughs> Breakfast. With graham crackers on the side? <laughs> With graham crackers on the side? <laughs> this is definitely going to be for a Saturday afternoon when you're out shopping, or evening, running errands, yes. or evening, mm -hmm. or something like that. Or you can actually, I think, that you can wear this to bed. Yeah. Because oh, you're just going to wear the band. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Because it just makes you feel so warm and cozy. <laughs> Especially during this time of year. <laughs> Alright, guys. So We've moved out of the winter months, yes. okay? <laughs> and now we're entering into spring and, and summer, summer scents, summer. you guys, okay? And so the first scent that I want to show you guys is one that I actually picked up last year. And I was looking for a scent that was more so on the vegan side, you guys, or the natural side. And so I picked this up. This is by Pacifica, and it's Indian Coconut Nectar 
perfume. It smells amazing. It does. It smells really, really it's good. It's so fresh, too. It is very fresh, you guys. And so, <laughs> the notes in this is vanilla, coconut, vetiver, and ambrosia flower. Now, I must say myself that I can't really smell vetiver in this. However, it does smell very, like, light and fresh with a huge, um, scent of coconut. I guess yeah. if that makes sense. Coconut is going to be the notes that sort of overpowers all of the other notes in this. So when you spray this on you, you are going to instantly smell that coconut and that vanilla. Now, the way that I wear this is, like if I'm going to work, I'll put this on because for me, I just don't want to waste my most expensive, expensive perfumes on, on your job. Exactly, <laughs> like save that for date night, exactly, you guys, exactly. or going out and kicking it with your girls or something like right. that. But yeah, so this is a scent that I would wear more so on an everyday basis, you guys, just to freshen up. You can also take this to the gym with y'all. All right, guys, so the next scent that I am bringing to you is one that became my favorite Probably about maybe Emma's. Right, the both of ours. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I think I want to say this was maybe eight years ago. Yeah, like man. a good eight years ago. Yeah. We have been rocking with this for a very long time. We have repurchased this over and over and over again. That is none other than Ellie Saab Le Parfum. <laughs> this is a bottle right here. I hope you guys can see that. But it's a beautiful bottle. As you can see, I use it very sparingly because a little bit goes a very long way, which mm -hmm. is really nice because you don't have to worry about reapplying it all day. It does stay on, guys. Now, the notes that's in the Ellie Saab is Mandarin Blossom, Gardenia, and Jasmine, and it also has a woody fragrance of honey, rose, and vetiver. I love woody scents, you guys. Yes, me too. Especially rose with like a woody scent mm -hmm. and then vetiver. Mm -hmm. And I don't know if you guys have watched our our other perfume video that we put up. If you haven't, we'll make sure that we include the card right here or right here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but in that first video, we talked about all of the scents that we absolutely love, and a lot of those are woody and vetiver. Woody and vetiver. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> and so there is a common theme with all of the scents that Kiana and I love, mm -hmm. and that is that they're gonna have some form of vetiver in them. Yeah. Well, hit hit Elisa yeah. right, right. has been a mirror in it. <laughs> so the price point on this one is about thirty eight dollars for a small and probably about 54 for the larger one and this is the larger one. And like I said, a little bit goes a long way, so you'll definitely get your money's worth. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay, and so I saved my favorite scent <laughs> for last. You guys. <laughs> and that is it's a good one, y'all. <laughs> that is Warm Cotton by Clean Reserve. It is now whole so cottony. It is. It smells so good. It makes it me is feel good. so good. I, know. Okay. <laughs> I still have it in the box. Let me just take it out for you guys. I bought the little, the, the sample, smaller oh, size. The smaller one. Oh, the travel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bought the travel size, you guys. This is um, 0.34 fluid ounces, y'all. Now, the price point for this is $28, you guys. And so that's why I spent my coin on the smaller one because it was my first time getting it and I'm just like, yeah, let me know what to expect. Yeah. yeah, how I like it. Now, let me tell you the reason that I love this. First of all, I love the size of this because you could just slide it in your purse if you're wearing a large or small size purse, which y'all know <laughs> the smaller size bags are in right now. So you can slide it in there. I wear this to the gym a lot of times, you guys. Honestly, I wear this with anything. You can. Like, I'll dress this up and down. It's a fresh scent. Like. It is. Now, 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 this scent leans more towards like the fresh citrus and fruit type scents. Mm. But the notes in this are bergamot, bergamot, mm. benzoin, musk, and it's fresh, clean, light, and it's airy. It's right. so airy, you it guys. Yes, let me see. Mmm. Man. Man, it's You nice. guys. Me and my friend, me, Kenya, like my husband and my friends, we all went out to like happy hour somewhere, you guys. And I sprayed this on. And when I tell you the amount of compliments that I received, <laughs> yes. like, and we're at happy hour. And so, of course, y'all know that when you go to happy hour, if it's at any restaurant or bar and grill or something like that, a lot of times it's packed. And it was. But I got so many compliments from wearing this scent, yes, you guys. You did, yeah. Now, my only gripe about, oh my gosh, I just smelt it. <laughs> It smells so it smells good. Nice. It smells like fresh laundry. It does. It smells it does. better than fresh laundry, y'all. 
then my only gripe about this is that as soon as you spray it, all you smell is alcohol. And it burns a little bit, you guys. You gotta let it die down. Yeah, and this is supposed to be more so on like the natural, the natural line in Sephora. Mm -hmm. I think it's natural or clean. Clean line. Clean line. Clean line in Sephora. That's what this is supposed to be, but it, it burns. So I think that the alcohol content in this is pretty high. Yeah. However, y'all, listen, y'all are gonna love this. <laughs> You can wear this to bed. Listen, put this on as soon as you get out the shower. <laughs> Spray it all over you. If you oh, got a spouse, boy, just get it on your spouse <laughs> with this sit on you, and he gonna be like, mm, right? Be. You coming to bed? Baby, you coming? You coming to bed anytime soon? Baby, coming <laughs> here. Come <laughs> here, girl. And you gonna be like, yes, dad. <laughs> <laughs> Love this though. Yes. <laughs> All right. Now this is a very inexpensive one. I'm talking like thirteen dollars and fifty cents. Inexpensive, probably cheaper than that. That is none other than Bath and Body Works Cucumber Melon, guys. Now I don't know if you all remember, but a couple years ago. Bath & Body Works did a throwback to all of their old scents. They sure did. And they put them all on the shelf. So it was like warm apple crisp, mm. cucumber melon, mm -hmm. some like freesia, something. I think there was like a pear a one. Pear. I picked it up. Yes. <laughs> anyway, I picked this up. This is one that I used to wear when I was in high school, y'all. You remember when we used to wear I remember. <laughs> oh my gosh, I remember. So I had to pick and dark this kiss, up. And dark kiss. Yes. Well, that was Victoria's Secret, mm -hmm. y'all. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> So I love this one guys because the notes in this one is uh, water honeydew, crisp cucumber obviously because it's cucumber melon, it's summer cantaloupe, sparkling grapefruit, and then sheer woods, whatever sheer woods is. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> anyway, it's just a bunch of fruit in this and it smells amazing. So this is one that I would definitely wear mm -hmm. in the during the summer months, you know, because it's not one of those real sweet scents. Yeah. It's nice and fresh, but it's like fresh fruit. And then the grapefruit, along with like the honeydew, it balances it out really, really well. So, like I said, it's not too sweet. Um, it's, it's a staple, as you can see, because mm -hmm. we used to wear it in high school. So we've been enjoying it for a long time. <laughs> Alright guys, so that wraps up this video. Make sure that you guys leave comments down below. Let us know what your favorite scents are. Yes. Also, what are your staple scents? And yes. what scents do you pick up that are less expensive than some of the higher brand scents that you've seen in our previous videos? Mm -hmm. We would love to know because we're always looking for a good, inexpensive perfume that's going to last. Yes. If you guys have enjoyed this video, again, comment down below. Make sure that you like it. Yes. And subscribe. And also. And also. Turn on that bell so that you'll be notified any and every time we, we post upload a new, a new video. video. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so much for tuning into this video. Again, do not be afraid to get that dialogue started with us by commenting down below in the description box. Let us know what other types of videos you want to see from us, y'all. We are very interested to know and we'll be very happy to bring that content to y'all. So, thank y'all so much for watching and until next time. Mwah. Bye. Bye.